Hi everyone, my name is Arvind. And my name is Sanjay. We are known as the Station Brothers. And we are also known for making Lego printers using the Lego Mindstorms kit. We are honored to have our brand new print and scan robot included in the Mindstorms 51515 Robot Inventor Kit. Now let me show you how you can access the code and building instructions for this project. As you can see, this is the Robot Inventor app and there is a community tab at the bottom. Pressing the community tab shows the list of all the fan inventions. And if you scroll down, you can see print and scan. Here you can find the building instructions as well as the code for the project. Now let's take a closer look at the model, beginning with the hardware side. Definitely the hardest part was being able to come up with an accurate printer with just the parts we had in one set. And the hardest part about this was being able to create an accurate linear motion mechanism without having any gear racks. And the way that we did this was by having a large gear reduction that we actually used a turntable for inside of this enclosure here and connecting it to these lift arms that convert the rotation to a linear motion of the printer head. We also have a distance sensor, which is used to calibrate the printer depending on where the users run their code when where they have the printer head, as well as a color sensor on the back, which is used for the scanning mode. Now we can take a look on the software side of things. By default, when you run our code on the hub, it will print the word Lego. However, you can change it to print any text that you want. We have included the bitmaps for the basic 26 letters of the Latin alphabet. Our code uses uh, the bitmaps and custom mathematical functions to move the print head and the wheels to any position on the paper to plot. This plotter even has the potential to be expanded to print any images you want. We, here are some samples from our initial tests. You should think about what you can print and bring your dreams to life. Now we're going to show you how to set up your model for printing or scanning. First, I'm going to insert this pen for printing. Now I will turn on the program and you will notice that it starts the calibration process automatically using the distance sensor. On the screen, you can see an animation helping you decide whether to print or to scan. You can press the left button to start printing whatever text you have entered in the program, or you can press the right button to scan your own drawing. As you can see, it is showing an L because that's the letter that it is currently printing at the time. It is printing the default uh, word Lego. Now we're going to show you how to scan an image. Now I'm going to put my printer on top of this drawing here that we've created, and I'm going to make sure that the color sensor is at the bottom of the image all the way to this side. Now I'm going to press the right arrow key, which 
puts it in scanning mode and it'll automatically start scanning. Once the scan is complete, you can then press the left button to print your scan. If your scan does not come out quite as you had hoped, you can always adjust the contrast setting in our code. At the end, you should have a replica of the drawing you drew by hand. We hope you enjoyed building our model. Let us know what you think of it, and please share with us all of the things that you print and scan. Bye!